don't know if this is, you know, global warming that I'm noticing or what it is. A cup of ice? really lousy day so I decided to just get out and head out to see if I could convince myself to eat among other things whoa it's really bright so um, my handbands came in yesterday which is, uh, I'm really happy about but I'm also sort of bummed because normally I like to pretty much get them and then use them. However, I can't. So, sort of a bummer. Um, Mom went back to work yesterday for the first half day. Um, she's thinking that, you know, working um, part days the rest of this week and, and then having a three day weekend is probably the best way to work back into going to work which is probably a wise idea because she's not back to full strength yet and I know yesterday she pretty much just came home and passed out yeah the last two days I've pretty much been a zombie for lack of a better word it is really warm out for the first day of September I mean seriously it's like 64 ish might wind up taking Key's gear off again today. Holy moofy. And yes, I think I just stole a word from Fry Life. Sorry, Mary. It is not supposed to be this temperature this time of year. Not in Juneau, Alaska. Nope. Hey guys, I thought I'd show you uh, the same trail I was on a couple months back where normally this time of year, like, we would already have frost and, like, yeah, it would be definitely fall, but not a whole lot has changed. I mean, yeah, there's some leaves in some areas, but let me show you. So, this area, because there's a lot more deciduous trees, has lost some leaves. And just, you can tell a little bit more that it's starting to be fall. But up here, it's almost like nothing has changed, really. For our area, and this is the 1st of September, this is like weird that it's still this green. this time of year normally the grasses would be at least yellow if not brown. You do have some of the skunk cabbages that got way too hot this year and so they've been kind of scorched. It just here has been so strange weather wise. I don't know if it's just Alaska that it's been like this or if it's everywhere. I know um, where my grandparents live in Anchorage, um, the ouch, uh, local uh, weather people are actually, um, yes I know very technical wording, uh, are actually saying don't uh, blame the yellow leaves on fall because it's not fall that's doing it. I mean, normally this time of year, all of these grasses would be completely yellow. It's not brown. I mean, it's just, I hate to say it, but it's almost still like summer. It's crazy. 
And here it is, September 1st, and it's 63 degrees. This is not normal for this area. It's absolutely crazy. I hate to say it, but I don't know if this is, you know, global warming that I'm noticing or what it is, but, I mean, last year I think we only had three, let's see, maybe eight snow days total, and I mean days of snow. We don't get what the lower 48 calls a snow day, it's just... I mean, we do have some plants like the fireweed that is gone for the year. And that's normally our cue that it's fall, you know, but it doesn't look like fall to you guys. Don't think so. And there are actually um, plants that are out, out of season that I've noticed. I mean, normally things like dandelions are here and, you know. May, early June, and then gone. I've actually seen them, not all over, but back uh, August, and even, you know, I've, I've seen them all through August, and even still here. So, little pieces of firewood back. It just has been such a crazy year. I mean, even the plants don't know what's going on. You know, it's bad when even the plants don't know what's going on.